I got a fish. Oh my god. Oh my god. What do you think's on it? Oh my god. We just got it. We just got it. Chris, we got one. We got one. We got one. On the RC boat. So we have our ceviche here. What is going on, all the peeps? Welcome back to another epic video, guys. Today, I'm here with Harvey. You guys have seen him in a bunch of my catch and cooks, and we actually have a special surprise for you guys. Come check this out. We have a really expensive RC boat. I just spent $200 on this RC boat, fully charged it. I tested it out. Comes with this nice, nice little remote right here. And uh, we're gonna tie some line to this, and we're gonna put it in the canal and catch the monster fish on it. So let's get right into the video, guys. So here's our RC boat. I've tied a loop knot to the back of it, and I could actually put a bait inside of here, and I could remote control open it to release the bait. And this thing's got trim tabs. This is like the craziest boat you've ever seen. Like, look at this remote. It shows you everything it has on it. It's got trim tabs. It's got lights. It's 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 decked out. But uh, without further ado, I'm gonna put this thing in the water and catch a fish on it. So I got some bread here. I'm gonna start feeding these fish. Look at them right there. Look, right there. Come on, come eat it. Get them all fired up. I want a big old fat chunk. Let's roll this thing up. Fat piece of bread. Got the RC boat right here. Take the line. Take the hook. Remote control boat. Just connected. We got, oh, okay, whoopsies. All right, and now we wait. I don't know how I managed to pull this off, but come close here. I managed to perfectly hook a, a rock. Uh, I don't know how I did that. Started pouring. Look, look at this. Pouring. Guys, we're underneath the bridge right now. Oh, hell no. Nah. Look at the spiders, bro. Wait, 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 wait. Behind you, all above you. Oh, uh, so you could literally hit the open button, put your bait in here. Michael, hit close. Check this out, guys. Look, look at this. And then your bait is secured. And then when you want to release the bait in the water, you just hit open. Drive this around. And when I want to yank it off, I'm just going to... Yeah. <laughs> All right, this should get eight any second. Ready? Here we go. Come on. Is the cichlid eating it? Yeah. Is it in the mouth? I think we got it. Do we have it? Do I have a fish? Oh, I got a fish. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> I actually got one. Oh my. Give me some, Michael. Let's go, baby. That's the first fish on the RC boat. Oh my gosh. Hold up. I need to get this. All right, ready? I'm gonna release it. All right, ready? Let me know you're ready. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, buddy, come here, come here. We're gonna release you. All right, here we go. That was sick. Let's go get another one. We are at a new spot now, and this spot has claw knife fish. And to prove you that point, there is literally a smelly dead one right here. Look at this thing. Oh. Harvey, can you smell that? Smells like, yep. Oh my god. But we're gonna go ahead and get this RC boat in the water and catch a monster fish. Guys, we've actually been fishing out here since 5 p.m., and it is now 9 p.m. We were hooking some nice fish, but unfortunately, we had bad weather. And we actually have a fish on the RC boat and it is stuck on there because my friend in the wheelchair accidentally ran over the remote. So we need to order a new RC boat. This is not over, but I need to snag this RC boat and uh, get the fish off of it. What do you think's on it? I don't know, dude. I mean, there's a lot of peacock and clown in here. No way. He the fish broke it. Wow. Oh my God. But guys, we're gonna go get food. We can't fish anymore, the RC boat broke. The remote on the RC boat did get ran over and we just lost the fish that we had on it. But we're gonna come back with a brand new RC boat and we're gonna get a fish. Alrighty guys, so we just finished getting bait and the craziest thing ever imaginable happened. So Chris was throwing the cast net and all of a sudden Chris is like, you see that tarpon right there? I'm like, what tarpon? And as soon as I said that, the Gulf Stream lure got absolutely annihilated and I set myself into uh, my personal best tarpon, and I fought that thing for a really long time. I'm gonna let the video speak for itself. This ain't the flash minnow! Oh my god! Oh my god Chris. Dude, the oh flash my minnow. God. Dude, we need to land this thing. Chris, that's a 200 pounder. That is insane. Chris, Chris. I have lots of line, don't worry, I have lots of line. You have lots of line there? Yeah. That's a good hook, that hook won't bend. Gold stream lures, baby. Oh 
Holy cow! This will be my BB tarpon. This is the biggest tarpon I've ever hooked. <laughs> Dude. Holy cow. That was the last thing we were expecting. I cannot believe Dude, that was, was right like, there. Chris was like, oh, look at that tarpon right there. I'm like, what tarpon? And then I hooked it. <laughs> On the Gulf Stream Flash Meadow. <laughs> oh, look at him just roll. Oh my God, he's so big, dude. Dude, that is awesome. Look at that. Look at the size of him. After fighting this fish for over 30 minutes on 30 pound line, we decided to beach the fish. And in doing so, something crazy happened. The tarpon got smoked by a hammerhead shark. Uh, literally smoked the tarpon in one gulf. And the thing was gone, but I'm gonna let the video speak for itself. I'm gonna let that thing roll. Where is he running? Ah! Ah! <laughs> oh, there's a shark on him. There's a shark on him, I think. Oh, dude, he's running. He's running fast. He's running, dude. No! Ah! I'm getting smoked. Go, 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 go. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> oh. My reels, the drag actually burned. That was the craziest thing that I've ever seen. But we're going to go ahead and fish with this RC boat at Chris's dock. And we're going to get some fish for ceviche. Alrighty, guys. So we have our RC boat. Let's turn this baby on. Boop. Let's connect it to the boat. Just connected it, and let's go ahead and take our little hook here, put it right onto this bait, just like that. And I'm just gonna toss this thing in the water. Actually, I'll just drop it lightly. There we go. And uh, ready for this, Chris? Let's see what happens there. All right, we're gonna go ahead and uh, weave it through here. Take it to the, the dock. We're taking it to the dock here. All right, RC boat is on. Let's uh, close this thing. Check that out. And uh, now we got our little bait on our little rig. We're gonna place it right here, and we're gonna drive this thing right to where we want it. All right, ready? I'm gonna open it. It's deloading the bait. It's loading the bait out. Bait. Oh, there he goes. So yeah, like I mentioned before, this RC boat got absolutely annihilated by my friend, but we saw, we welded it together, and uh, now we're gonna wait until we get a bite. So we'll see you guys when we have a fish. We just gotta, we just gotta wait. Chris, we got one. We got one. We got one. We got one. What is it? What is it? What is it? Right, come on, come, 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 come on. Move it, move it. No, 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 no. Let's not get it. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? We still got him. We still got a fish. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. What do we got? What do we got? Is he pulling? Oh, oh we got a jack! We got a jack! We got a jack! Oh, look at that! Look at that! We got a beautiful jack right here. Look at that! Look at that, guys! Got a little horse eye jack. This is actually not a Jack Crevel. This is called a horse eye jack. We're actually gonna keep this guy for shark bait. You hear him croaking? Oh, it's croaking. We're gonna keep him for shark bait. So we're gonna go ahead and throw him in the cooler. Oh. I think he's eight. He's eight. Oh my god, he's pulling the boat under. Come on, come on. What is it? What is it? Oh my god, it's a snapper. We got a mango. <laughs> Turn. Come on. Come on. Come back here. Come to Papa. Yes. Come to Papa. No. Come to Papa. Oh my dude, it's a nice snapper. It's a nice snapper. Chris. Look at oh that. My god. It's a nice snapper, Chris. It's a nice snapper. You just tried taking oh, off. Look, 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 look. He's the keeper, he's the keeper, he's the keeper. Cheese, he's ceviche, he's dinner, he's done. <laughs> oh my god, he's done, he's done, he's done. Can't reach the boat. Put the boat in first. Oh my god, he's, he's keeper, dude, he's keeper. That's keeper all day. Oh, he's barely hooked, he's barely hooked, Chris. That whipper die! Oh Yo. my god, let's go, dude, that's a big, <laughs> that's a big snapper boy. Oh my god, Chris, he's, look, barely hooked, dude. Look, look, that hook will pop right, oh my god, Chris, we almost lost him. <laughs> He's going right into the ice bucket. Woo! What's up, Come close. Okay. Just like that. Put it in there. Yes. Now we take this thing and we toss it in the water. All right, let the thing go, baby. Back to the pilings. There we go. Back in there. Yo, Dakota, 
Yo, what's happening? Yo, yo, we got something on here. It's yeah, pulling. Let's go fish. Oh, yeah, buddy. Oh, oh my god. Ready? Look Ready? at this. Three, two, go. Oh, dude, we're working him. He must be small. Let's bring him. Yeah. Small. Let's just bring him down. The I think that's a grouper, dude. It's a gro grouper. You're lying. No, dude, look at it. Oh my god, we can't turn it. We can't. Wait, wait, no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> no. Chris. Dude. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Look at this. What? What? I don't see it. Hold on. I just saw him right there. Oh my god, we got a grouper! We got a baby grouper! <laughs> oh, we can keep him too! That's that's ceviche, boy! Dude, Let's go! We got it! <laughs> Yo, hey, we're having some ceviche tonight, boy! Oh okay. yeah. Look at that thing, guys. That is beautiful. Oh yeah. That is absolutely gorgeous. That is gonna make some killer ceviche, guys. Hold on, let me hold this up for you guys. On the RC boat. That is absolutely insane, guys. We're gonna go ahead and cook this thing up. All right. Dinner. Yeah, homie. We're gonna take our first fish here, the mangrove snapper. Ooh, that ice slush. Look at that. Beautiful snapper. Come behind the head, just like that. Behind the head here. Cut through right there. Cut right through the back of the fin. Got this strawberry grouper. Gonna cut right behind the head. Grouper's a lot softer to cut than a snapper is. Let's go right down the bones, down the back. Look at that. Snapper, grouper. No comparison. No comparison. Grouper going in. All right, guys, so we got our fillets. I'm just gonna trim off a little bit of the excess in the bloodline. Just cutting it down. We're gonna cube these up into like little, small, little, tiny little cubes. And then um, we're gonna get, here's all the ingredients. We got red onion, we got garlic minced, we got salt. We got a, I forgot how you do it, but um, got little tiny celery. Then we got, uh, I think, I forgot the name of this pepper too, but nice pepper. It's not a habanero. And then um, got fresh, fresh, fresh cilantro, of course. And then we got our lime juice right here. Got a little ginger. And of course, we have our cook. Chopped up the grouper, chopped up the snapper, and then it was time to put the ingredients in the bowl. All right, so here is our fish. Now we're gonna add just a little bit of the lime juice. Sorry, the salt first. Go ahead and coat that thing with salt right here. Just like, like salt bay. <laughs> a little salt on it, you know? Make sure there's a nice coating of salt all over it. That's what Chef taught me. You want salt to be a nice little layer around all the meat. Now, we're going to take the knife. We're going to go straight over here to the cilantro. And we're going to just chop all the cilantro up and toss it in there. All of that celery. Like, not all of it, probably. Like you garlic or no? Okay. I love garlic. Sweet, me too. Yeah. <laughs> garlic. You, you could it. go as much as you want on it. Take the whole pepper, drop it right in. And then you take some ginger paste. A little bit. Get the most important ingredient. That's a go ahead. The lemon just, and lime. Look how that's looking. That will burn your cuts. Oh yeah. If you have any right now, you'll I feel do. it. And I do feel it. <laughs> that pepper don't doesn't even need to be diced, huh? Nope, it just sits in there. That's how spicy nice. it is. Final ingredient, orange juice. Secret. Shh, I told nobody. Just a little bit. Now 
let that mix in just a little bit more. That's it. Go ahead and put this in the fridge. We'll see you guys when it's cured. So we have our ceviche here. Check that out. Smells absolutely delicious. And I got some chips here from Los Bocados. These are fresh chips. And uh, we're gonna, oh, there breaks the chip, but uh, get some ceviche here. Pretty good, yeah? Try some of this. Get the nice scoop there. Oh man, <laughs> that is good. Give it a one to ten. That's some good ceviche, man. That is a ten, bro. That is so good. Man, this is gonna be going back tonight. That is amazing. Nothing better, bro. Nothing better. We made it happen, dude. Nice job, guys. If you haven't dude. already, you need to book with Captain Chris the Bull. His phone number will be right here on the screen. He will make it happen. He always does. And if you haven't, if you don't believe me yet, check out my last video. I'll put that right here. But as always, guys, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Peace. Oh, you're eating the whole thing? Uh, 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 uh. Is it hot? It's hot. <laughs> <laughs> Scorpion pepper. It's like the detox right now.